Hello and welcome back to Massive Channel's first stream Lord Cinder the Mad. Now, last time we were about to initiate a new mission. And I think this sounds like a good one because we don't have a single female cover check. Which really isn't all that important information wise anyway, but uh, we really don't have enough fertile females. On the, on the other hand, having a level 2 alchemist may be pretty useful in regards of uh, the fact that we are building sage rights. So I could just hire like uh, more heroes as time goes on. I forgot to ask, you know, if you had any ideas on which one I should do first, but I'm gonna go with this one. Of course, now's the issue that... Do you feel it? That little tingling in the air before a fight? I know they do. Here is where you can make any last-minute substitutions or preparations before you deploy your heroes to battle. Once you give the word, they'll jump in, and we'll handle the rest. Make sure they close their mouths when they jump. Here's the thing, Belia. Belia, Belia, Belia. You... Your movement speed... Is four minus one. Really? Is is that all? Because he wasn't able to move at all, basically. How's your movement speed? Four minus one as well. Uh, they're all level one, right? Level one, level one, level one. So, what can we replace you with? You have a, you're a cabbage. Shake of iron hand. What are you? Alright, you are not too bad. We we'll take you instead for our cabbage checker needs, especially since you're level 2. So that may be pretty useful. Uh, who else was slow? Very slow? Dude, very slow? You're really slow. In that case, do we have anyone with good movement speed? 4 plus 1. Hell yeah. Alright, and uh, here. I should actually look at other stats as well, other than just uh, moon speed. On the other hand, moon speed is quite relevant. Okay, let's have a second alchemist on it with us as well. They're both canes. Uh, do we have any other? Well, having multiple people in house cane being well enough equipped to handle dangers isn't a bad idea. Okay, you, 4 minus 1, you, 4 minus 1. I want a hunter, really. So that's a 4, and you are also a 4, otherwise strength 2, dexterity 5, uh, dexterity 5 plus 3, strength 2 there. What does dexterity... I don't really know. Alright, you're going with us, just in case. Yeah. So you have two alchemists from House Kane, an Iron Hand, Gubberjack. And two Mirandas, which are both male hunters. Sure. One of your heroes looks a little queasy. Maybe tell them it'd be best not to eat right before a jump. And now there's a turkey leg floating in our bowl. Wait. Okay, you are one of the hunters, so can you take a shot already? You can! You can also miss. You can miss terribly. Uh, Here you have the hunter. Second attack in close range is good, but attacking from afar, where one can think and plan, is better. If you listen closely, you might be able to hear your group leaving you behind as you line up that perfect shot. Actually, the hunter will be in front of the group, stealthily scouting ahead. Is that what they say they're doing? Okay, I don't think that either. Oh, it's that's how the grid is. Okay, move there. Oh no. I admire the ruptures. I don't. They rush into battle, no concern for their own safety, knowing that as soon as they come upon their prey, they'll explode into a corrosive mess of pain and suffering. Even in death, they still hurt their enemies. It's beautiful. And disconcerting. That's uh, that's a few enemies. Okay. Ah. 
found one of our alchemists. I got two. Not worth much in a close quarters battle, but they make up for it with their nasty exploding flasks. Just watch out for friendly fire. The explosions are big, so aim well or keep your heroes back. Trust us, you don't want to be on the receiving end of one of their concoctions. Alright, move that there so the alchemist can as well move closer because the rupture, we don't want the rupture getting anywhere close to our units. So here you go, alchemist. You get a kill. Rouse Kane! Yeah, sure. Because they do that, and that shit over there that damages my units even after. This is a caber jack. People are dead. Sometimes they hit hard and put things down. Other times they hit not so hard and just knock things out. That's all you're going to say. Simplest way of life there is. Caber jacks. Profound purveyors of violence. And can you? F no. Oh shit! I keep forgetting that the right click does not, in fact, cancel an action, but confirms it instead. Wow. That was a lot more damage than what the other guy got him. Uh, you get Iron Hand more items, please. Yeah. House Iron Hand is currently among our favorites, for sure. Okay, you go ahead and scout about. Or at least pretend to be doing so. No one goes into the corrosive acid shit. Because that's not a nice place to be. So everyone is just gathering up in this huge pile, hoping that there is no sudden ruptures running out of nowhere, because well that would actually be very pretty bad. Okay. There's no uh, action such as Overwatch or Hunker or anything like that, so yeah. Okay. I just remembered that stealth moving is actually an option here. Like... Oh, right. Stealth move also requires you to actually walk against an item to stay in stealth. So we're currently not in range of anything like that, so might as well just move on. Alright. Uh, can you stealth move over there? Okay. I forgot how stealth move works at first. But we remember now. We remember how it started. Dorothy is just like yesterday. I just remember doing what it uh, hey, hey, no. That's that's irrelevant. Alright, uh now we still don't actually have anything in sight. So if we stealth move over there we remain in the same situation where we don't actually have anything in sight. Okay, you actually be a little bit careful. You are slightly, slightly damaged. It happens to the best of us. Okay, where can we stealth move? Anything on the outside of the tree? Nope, there's a push over there. It doesn't count. He can scout in that direction, but if someone bounces into him, he's dead. Oh, oh, there's the ruptures. And there's a seed. Okay, well... This thing... I don't really want to come back here yet. What can you find? Wait. Oh, it's these three who are... Okay. We'll deal with this situation first. Not ideally, of course, because we only have two archers at hand. But we do have one archer, I mean. But we have two alchemists, so there is that. Alchemists can be pretty good in solving this sort of threats. Okay, move a little. See what you can do. Nothing. So don't do anything. Good. You move closer as well. Uh, I need to have them spread out a bit, I guess. Because otherwise, uh, they may end up just uh, getting destroyed. 
Don't tell me that's corrosive. That isn't corrosive. Good. Okay, get, you get over there. Ooh. Now you're just fine over there. What was the key? Tap? Yeah. Okay. Now stealth move over there. Try not to get caught. Good. Still didn't find anything good there. And you remain stealthy. Okay, one of the options has noticed us. So we have something to look to forward to. That could be kill shot. The issue with that is... Can I see how many kills you have, sir? Uh, kills. Like... No, no, you, you are not willing to inform us of the number of your achievements. Uh, he is open. That was close enough. Even as a miss, that was close enough. Okay, you? That was not close enough. Alright, Archer. Step back a little. Hope you weren't seen and take fire. And you explode. And you, Gamma Jack. It's for the best if you don't do anything right now. Okay. You continue scouting out the area. See if there's anything hidden in the back. Doesn't really look like it yet. Okay. Step ahead of the archer because the archer is more fragile. Though we don't really want either of them getting hurt. Oh! I think the seed spotted us. Or we spotted the seed? So we were aware of the seed's presence over there before. Okay. Let's see what we can do here. Throw flask. Let's go with the 47% one. Maybe he'll throw further if he misses. He did! That's very convenient. Uh, Hunter, you can have this. If you can aim this. You cannot. Which means House Kane gets this skill once more. Housekill enjoys killing ruptures, it's one of the special specialties, yeah? Yeah. And that is one leveled up house canine. K9. <laughs> no, they're not canines, it's just a. Yeah, okay. You wanna go over there? Doesn't sound risky at all. You? Uh, a rupture and a seed over there in the back. Okay, that's good to know. This is the thing. Once we get our second archer moving as well, we can uh, scout out the rest of the area. Maybe, just maybe, this is all there is. Like, no, don't shoot at him. I'm not actually sure if we would be able to get over here, but I'd prefer if we did not try it out. Okay, can I step behind you and then kill you? Yes, good. And that is a level 3 caper check. I can't say that I mind. Okay, Archer. You can't stealth move into anywhere useful. Which means just stepping somewhere useful instead. But we will need uh, him to go first, I think. Okay, so cancel stealth move because it doesn't really work right now. Go over there so we can get a straight line to where there is no corrosive acid that will kill us. Sounds good to me. And you? Uh, same strategy, basically. And you? Same strategy, base. Oh. Yeah, you can just wait there. Who else has a turn? You do. Well, I turned then. Stay stealthy. We don't want the rupture noticing anything. The ruptures are a nightmare in my opinion. I just don't like things that die when they... Well, explode when they die. Especially in a game where, where I do actually have melee units. Uh, two more ruptures. I'm running terribly low on flasks, really. 
This is not ideal. My own fault though. Okay, we have two flasks remaining on this guy, which means one flask remaining on the other guy, right? No, two on him as well. Okay. Not too bad then, but still really bad. Okay. You and you. You're the last ones remaining, so... Get over that. Get it over with. Okay, that's one rupture moving. Looks to be the limit of his current activities. Okay, we can still move over there. That's not really all that useful. Okay, uh, cancel that. I got a plan. Can you reach that? You cannot. In that case, the plan is irrelevant. Uh, let's just try to set up things for next turn. And, uh... Can I turn my camera? Yes, I can! How good for me to know. Okay, you... You don't want to do anything right now, do you? Actually, you kind of want to level up, I think. But that does mean getting some... Uh, we can get the... Uh, Seed from without... Oh, there's two seeds over there. Hmm. I think you can take on both of them. How's your XP? They're below. low. They're below, indeed. Well, maybe we can spare him a kill. Okay, and turn, and turn, and turn. Oh, three seeds over there. Okay, they're moving. And if we land this perfectly... Wait, wait. Cancel that for a moment. Uh, I need a cover check to move out of the way a little. And then... If this lands perfectly... Hmm... I want the archer to have one of these kills. But he's not accurate enough to guarantee one. Give it a try anyway. Nope, he missed. Let's hope no one else saw him. And throw another flask. He probably went up now. Oof. Grossy shit everywhere. Is the red past? Uh, nope, only true. Is there anything on that side of the map? That is a question. That is in fact a question. A terribly relevant one, but it's a question. Okay, you can't hit that. Can you step over there? See if that gives you better odds. Nope, you're just not terribly accurate. Well, give it a try anyway. Nope, that didn't work. Well, that means that guy over there is in a bit of a trouble. Really mess of shit. Okay. There's no way for him to get over to the other side from here right now, is there? Maybe if he doesn't go to the middle, maybe that doesn't damage him. Oof. Ah, there's the third seed. Whoops. And they did warn about getting swarmed. They did. And that's what happened. He got swarmed, he died. It was bound to happen sooner or later, so you should get used to this now. Oh. There'll be a lot more before we're done. Remember, they're fighting for something bigger than themselves. Persevere and honor their sacrifice. Indeed. Next time, let's just not do anything that requires sacrifice. Okay, uh, let's modify the camera angle a little. We want to take out the rupture first, I think. Which requires... The rupture actually noticing me. Not my favorite part of the plan. Oh. Oh. Well, uh, that also is not my favorite part of the plan. So, three seats over there. One of which accidentally revealed the archer, who is now going to get knocked around a fair bit. Uh, well, by fair bit, I meant a bit more than that, but... 
We got lucky, I guess. We want the rupture dead. I think that is the primary concern. Can you... Well, you can't stealth move when you're in line of sight of anyone, can you? No, but you can run away. Right, where was the rupture? Oh, he was the one with the line of sight of the rupture. Well, that complicates things. Not by terribly really much, but you know, slightly. See if you can bomb the bastard. Yep, that was in fact bombing the bastard. And you? I don't think there is any way to get properly close to the bastard, so uh, you can have this kill. No, you can't. You can m miss terribly. Well, that's how it went downhill. If the rupture actually gets close enough, we may get in trouble. Oh, and that's dead alchemist. And that may be a dead alchemist as well. We'll see in a second. Yes, that is a dead alchemist. Not the best place to stand, buddy. Okay, you need to run away. I think this is the best place where you can currently run. Which means this archer will need to pull through and actually kill someone. Get a little closer, take the shot. Nope. That is, in fact, not a death. The Cabbage Jack still has a lot of limes though, maybe, just maybe, yes. We got lucky. The character decided to attack the Cabbage Jack. Can you get this kill, please? You can. Uh, reading the news isn't necessary. I, I did do that poorly, I don't need to be hung for this. don't need to be hung for this. You stay hidden. Let them all go for the Gabba. How's Iron Hand? Apparently the hand of uh, a very sturdy tanks. Okay, I kind of want you to actually kill this guy. For House Kane. Because House Kane took a lot of damage this round. You took your hits and stood strong. A ruler after my own heart. Yes, and if you take a week to celebrate and don't remember your name by the end, then you really will be. Yep. That wasn't ideal. Uh, we got another level 2 alchemist there. Who did who had the houses? Iron Hand, which is excellent. We want House Iron Hand to stand tall and strong forever. And then we have House Tarantino. Oh. Well, I think he's the sole hair. That is actually not ideal. Hmm. Well, I hope they get some kids soon because otherwise. Who is Logrand Mitra? Tell me you're Logrand Mitra. No, you're Cesara and Johanna. Hmm. Okay, what do we have here? Oh, that's the past, isn't it? Yeah. What's over there? Sage right built, marriage. Oh, that's also the past. There's the future. Let us head on then, to the future! And let's hope th uh, that house... I remember the day I finished Iron Hand training and die. set off for the capital. There was a lot of crying. Mostly from the kids I crushed during my advanced gouging final. What a day that was. It 
always arrives faster than one expects. And now you're a massive chalice. Okay, Aqua Iron Hand, Bountiful, Queen Maker, Avenger. <laughs> you, little girl, you'll do just well. <laughs> Actually, no, you'll do excellent. How much is stats? 8 dexterity, 7 strength. Phew. Yeah, you'll do pretty well, I think. You can stealth move. Okay, yeah, sure. We have a cabaret check that can stealth move. Just think about that for a moment. We have a cabaret check who can stealth move. I don't at all mind that. Before you were making choices on the battlefield. Now you'll be making choices on the battlefield of life. <laughs> what? Come on. I will not apologize if I'm passionate about You know when you guide the heroes in battle. Well, sometimes the people, your heroes included, will want your advice on matters they can't decide themselves. They'll be putting their choices in your hands, and sometimes their lives. And the decisions you make may affect the morale of the nation. Unfortunately, we've learned that the cadence feeds off grief and malcontent. So if something tragic happens, corruption can spread very quickly. But the opposite is true, too. We will trust your decisions, whatever they end up being. Jacob Ironhand stands before you with a wheezing old man. I was doing my rounds outside of the capital when this old culture comes running out from the forest. Tells me that he's part of a group that worships the gate and said that one of the towns nearby is attacking his mates. The old man puts his hands up. We don't want to hurt anybody. Please help us. Um. Um. Arrest the cult, of course. We can't have Cadence worship when we're fighting the Cadence. That's just... Jacob turns to the village and promises to guard safety in the dungeons. As the members are shackled and taken away, the village sets back to its own habits of five festivals and three pea graces. Okay, cool. So Jacob actually gained something from that. So uh, Jacob, a good old Jacob Iron Hand. Age 54, don't die of old age. Stalwart. You don't actually... I can't... Uh, okay, details. This is where we can actually take a look at what Stalwart means. The hero's defensive bearing increases armor effectiveness. Ah, well. Jacob, you have been a great service to us thus far, so... Uh, keep going. Okay. The Sage Guild is almost complete. I think... Uh, well, I'll keep sk skipping until we actually get a new attack anyway. So Sage Rite's Guild has been built now. Ah, Sage Rite's Guild. I was always jealous of those in my class who went on to join their ranks. They ended up designing the rotary trebuchet, still used in keeps to this day, as well as the first oak and stone crossbow. First time I went to one, I came in for an armor fitting, and by the end, both of my arms were on fire. <laughs> what a bunch of brilliant scamps they are. Okay, what's that e was relevant for that intuition? So the best intuition is Athos Kane, but it's currently part of my vanguard. And that will mean that the Kane name will not carry on, but I want the Kane name to carry on. Ah, uh, Altfeld. I basically only got you so I could put you on the Sage Rites, really. What is that still? Infertile. <laughs> well, that. Uh, <laughs> First of many, I hope. <laughs> that certainly. Of are a hard thing to leave, but I always found the thrills of inquiry and invention to be worthy substitutes. Just don't get carried away with appointments. Sage Rites can never return to battle, and last I checked, we still need heroes to win this war. Seriously though, the, <laughs> the fact that he was in fertile kind of made the decision for me, didn't it? Okay, we can't have uh, either of the Iron Hands here. Though I'm impressed that uh, Aqua has such a good intuition level, uh, even at age 17. Oh god, she's 17 already? She hasn't seen battle yet. Okay, there are a lot of Akatashis. And uh, I think that Beliar 
past the past that we first had on our vanguard. So he's punished by making him actually serve us in a way that it makes sense for us. And Anders, I'm sorry, but you will also have to join this table. That is a decent bonus, I think. Okay, let's see what we can do. This could be really fun. Oh. Unstable. <sighs> yeah, okay. Ramp cap cable that also requires ruptures. What is this? Wellness ring sold outside the gap, it is supposed to promote good health for the wearer. With some riches, we could modify them to increase, increase the maximum health of a hero. Uh, I think this would be very valuable. Assuming it's something I can just take on to battle with me without having to research it every time. Johanna Miranda Partner of Regent Cesare Tarantino has died at the age of 57. Uh, Tarantino, can I... Tarantino, I don't think you can continue that bloodline. Uh, Aqua has high fertility. Of course, she of course she does, but... You can have this... Uh, Okay, you can have the younger one, I think. But she's slow. But so is Alessandra. You get the Frey. The Frey name will be forgotten. Make sure the Tarantino name lives on. And as years go by, there's another child born. And there's the attack. Now, of course, we don't have any other uh, choice but to go there because otherwise the I don't want to lose the territory and that already has one of those things plus a young level 1 male alchemist is probably more useful to me than a newborn baby boy puppy boy okay did you guys have a child uh, hey I can't look at that right now because sadly combat is at hand. Oh well, uh, if you disagree with my strategy of going and protecting this area this time, let me know if you think the baby boy is more valuable than the young male alchemist. Anyway, thanks for watching, I'll see you next time.